Here's how you can easily get wireless full body tracking without a PC using the Vive Focus Vision and the Vive Ultimate trackers. Let's start with the equipment that you'll need to make this all happen. First is a VR headset like the Vive Focus Vision. Next is the Vive Ultimate trackers for full body tracking. And yes, you can have up to five of these. And next, a Wi-Fi connection. I didn't want to unplug my router, so it won't be added to the table. And VR chat, which you can download for free from the Vive Port store in headset. I'm gonna show you how to connect to all these pieces of tech and set this up. Step number one is to set up your play space in the Vive Focus Vision. First, assign your floor height and then your boundary. Make sure to actually mimic your space so you won't run into anything. Okay, that's your VR safety tip for the day. Let's move on. Next, you'll set up your ultimate trackers by connecting them to your headset via the USB-C dongle. You can plug this into the front or the side of the headset. Once plugged in, your headset will prompt you to follow this little guy around the screen going through the logs. Follow this through until the scan is complete. Make sure to click the pair new button. Then you'll be able to click and hold the button on the top of the ultimate trackers, go through each one individually, holding the button down until you see blue blinking lights. After connecting each one, you can assign their role to the character on the right. Since you can have up to five trackers, you'll want to put one on your waist, two on each ankle, or on your foot, depending on the game. For VR chat, you'll get the most out of your tracking if you use your foot, so you can achieve movements like toe pointing, which you wouldn't get if you put your trackers on your ankles. As for the last two trackers, you can put them above your knee or above your elbow. The most important part here is to have track straps that will fit around these parts of your body comfortably. Next, you should be able to see the trackers in your headset. And you can check them anytime by clicking the Vive logo button to see if they're in place. You'll also see these blue numbers hovering above each one showing you which tracker is which according to the setup menu. If a tracker ever drifts, get disconnected, moves off, and flings your limb into oblivion, you can try things like holding the trackers in front of your chest, covering it with your hand for a few seconds, and then reattaching it. You can also try disconnecting the trackers by holding the button until they turn off. Then you can turn them back on by holding the button for about a second or two until the lights turn green. For step three, after all of your tech is set up, you can now go to the Viveport store to download VR chat. And it's a free download. After it's ready, launch the app and log in or create an account. Once you're in, unless your home world has a mirror, you can open up a personal mirror by clicking B, which brings you to your radial menu, which will eventually get you to your personal mirror. Follow the movements I'm making here on screen that will bring you to your personal mirror. You can grab this and move it around to your liking. Then you can go to your VR chat menu and click calibrate. Align your trackers in the correct spot and click trigger. You now have full body tracking with the Vive Focus Vision, allowing you to go standalone mode. If you're wanting to get the Vive Focus Vision and the Vive Ultimate trackers, make sure to check out our holiday deals on our website. And I'll be leaving that link below. For the Ultimate trackers, you can get the three plus one kit at this price here. And for the Focus Vision, our holiday sale starts November 18th. You'll be able to get the Vive Focus Vision at this price, as well as choose one of a few game packs where you can get somewhere from four to five games. And if you're looking to customize a model to make your VR chat experience even better, I recommend watching this video next.